want tasers on full charge. Sorry, there's no way to get up to the raptor pen until the new generator gets unpacked and built. Whew, how about that temperature, huh? I am so glad we got handed with three ice pops in one. licking the ends of these things. Jeez. I want tasers on full charge. Oh, come on. Who tore up the cage trap? I tell you, that raptor ain't budging until it gets fixed. So, do you know what to do if the raptor escapes? Yeah, the dude said to get up somewhere high so it can't reach you and only use our weapons as a last resort. Oh, so there's a proper plan. Uh, I'm just gonna you over to this rack. Hey! Well, how does this panel work again? Security code again, will ya? Good luck. I can't figure that panel out at all. Joffrey, raise the gate.
Velociraptor? No, not Velociraptor. Maybe one of the other dig sites has turned up something. Ugh, all I keep finding are old coins. What? Really? Amazing! Huh? How so? Well, until now, we had no idea. Oh, I can feel it. There's a raptor right under here. Yep, I am bang on target. I just gotta keep digging for a couple of more minutes. Just a little further. Oh, come on! It was there? I was so close. Lost raptor? Yeah, it's good shape, too. Settler and Grant want us to be especially careful when digging up this fossil. I say, not as I do, and next time I'm just bringing a sandblaster. This robe, what is it, a reef knot? Maybe it's a bowline? Come on! 
Boom! Phew! I'll be extinct by the time I get this thing out. A jackhammer? Oh, now we're talking. I promise I'll be careful. Uh, that might need some assembly. Six inch retractable claw, like a razor, on the middle toe. Dr. Grant! Dr. Ellie! We're ready to try again! I hate computers. Feelings, Mage. I give up. You give it a try. Uh, be careful. That rope's holding up uh, some, you know, uh, oh, don't, what's it called? Uh, no. Delicate equipment. That's it. It was holding up a bunch of delicate equipment. Oh, uh, sorry. <gasps> I found a perfectly preserved Compsognathus thigh. Really? Uh, no. That's mine. I had chicken legs for lunch. Okay, I figured out what's wrong with it. It should have two wheels, not one. And handlebars. That's why you fell off of it, Dave. No handlebars. Can I be of assistance? Yeah, that's much safer. It was really hard to just balance on it. That's great. Now it looks like the picture in the instructions. Shoot the radar into the ground and the bone bounces the image back. This program is incredible. Two more years and we won't have to dig anymore. Where's the fun in that? Looks like a six foot turkey. <laughs> no.
who do you think you are? Ah! <laughs> John Hammond. I own an island. Kind of biological preserve. Really spectacular. Spared no expense. Our attractions will drive kids out of their minds. If I could just persuade you to sign off on the park, I could get back on schedule. What kind of park is this? It's right up your alley. So you two, um, dig up, dig up dinosaurs? <laughs> well... Try to. <laughs> we'll have to get used to Dr. Malcolm. He suffers from a deplorable excess of personality, especially for a mathematician. Chaotician. Chaotician, actually. Center on the road over there. Spares, get them from storage, not from one of the control panels. Let's get something straight, John. Your investors, whom I represent, are deeply concerned. 48 hours from now, if they aren't convinced, I'm not convinced. I'll shut you down, John. <laughs> Species of Veriform has been extinct since the Cretaceous period. I mean, this thing is a hunt. This thing. <laughs> it's. It's a dinosaur. We're gonna make a fortune with this place. How fast are they? Well, we clocked the T-Rex at 32 miles an hour. T-Rex? Mm hmm You said you've got a T-Rex? Uh-huh. Say again. <gasps> we have a T-Rex. <sighs> <sighs> Dr. Grant. My idea is up to such. Welcome to Jurassic Park.
Why'd you do this? I'll show you. Those gates ain't moving until they install the gears and whatnots. Which is fine by me, because they've only got herbivores on this side of them. You'll find a great dino fat just down there. The most advanced amusement park in the entire world. <laughs> Why don't you all sit down? Just one drop of blood contains billions of strands of DNA, the building blocks of life. A hundred million years ago, there were mosquitoes, just like today. Sometimes, after biting a dinosaur, the mosquito would land on the branch of a tree and become fossilized. This is what we call amber. Using sophisticated techniques, Jurassic Park scientists extract the preserved blood from the mosquito and now we can make a baby dinosaur. Good day, Henry. Oh, good day, sir. Perfect timing. They imprint on the first creature they come in contact with. That's it. So I'm trying to control your attempting is uh, it's not possible. Listen, if there's one thing the history of evolution has taught us, it's that life uh, finds a way. What species is this? Uh. It's a Velociraptor. <laughs> They're lethal at eight months, and I do mean lethal. I've hunted most things that can hunt you, but the way these things move, 50, 60 miles per hour if they ever got out in the open. <laughs> they remember. Let's feed these overgrown lizards then. Come on, let's go. Uh. Well, these cages aren't going to be big enough. You can barely fit a goat in.
That's better. Now we just add cap. Jurassic World.